Hello everyone, welcome, I'm Robert, and this is another playthrough of Star Wars Destiny Encounters. Today I'm going to play against uh, Darth Vader on easy difficulty, and I'm using the Luke and Han Solo uh, pre-constructed uh, deck, uh, but uh, this is a um, deck that's made of combining two of those starter decks, okay? Uh, so I combine both uh, with the best cards that I thought would make sense for playing with encounters, and that way I also got my two characters with elite dice. Uh, and uh, we're almost done with setup, I just need to roll to see who goes first, and to see whose battlefield will come uh, in play for this game. Uh, and I am playing with the advanced battlefields module, uh, so you're gonna need that. Uh, so that Vader can bring his battlefield in case he wins the roll-off. And I'm also using the, um, I'm going to use the advanced discard and hand effects so that I can use uh, Han's discard phase more effectively, okay? So now we're going to roll to see who goes first. Okay, so we got two, three, four, five. Okay, and then we roll Vader. Okay, so... Looks like we got uh, three, oh, sorry, no, actually two, one. So it looks like we got three in total. Okay, uh, there's a zero. So we got three in total. Uh, so that means that I'm gonna go first. So we're gonna forget about Vader's battlefield for this. And uh, we're gonna use uh, Outer Rim Outpost, okay? Now, because, um, because we won with uh, our battlefield, uh, I'm gonna pick uh, from the generic battlefield card. I'm gonna assign it uh, the uh, I'm gonna assign it the ability that makes the most sense, uh, and in this case it would be uh, this one. Okay, yeah. Uh, number two, if the enemy has no resources, they gain one resource. So that's gonna be how the enemy will use the battlefield ability card. Okay, so we're gonna tuck that under. Uh, and because I won, I have control of the battlefield first. So I'm gonna have the green arrow pointing at me, and re remember. We flip this to figure out when the battlefield is claimed. Uh, and because I go first, the uh, enemy leader gains two shields uh, bonus. Uh, so now uh, we're ready uh, to go. Uh, well, almost. I need to still draw uh, my hand. Okay. Uh, let's see what we got. So one, two, three, four, five. Uh, this looks really good. So I'm actually going to keep this hand. Okay. Um, all right. So uh, let's see. Uh, I want to play. Um, I want to play a hidden blaster. Uh, let's play that on. Um, do I want to play that on Luke or uh, Han? Um, let's play that on Han. Okay, I'm gonna play a hidden blaster on Han. All right, and uh, that has ambush, so I'm gonna pay the two resources for that. That has ambush, so I take an extra action, uh, and then it says um, after you play this upgrade. Uh, I may remove one shield from uh, a character, okay? So uh, I'm going to remove a shield from Vader, and I have an additional action, okay? Uh, let me go ahead and put um, put that um, uh, Hidden Blaster die there. Um, and now I'm going to, uh, for my second action, I'm going to activate Han, but I'm going to do it using Smuggler's Run. So Smuggler's Run, uh, activate one of your yellow characters. If one or more of its character or, or upgrade dies, just roll resource, gain a resource. So let's see what happens, okay? Okay, so we got two, uh, two, two, and uh, I'm gonna reroll this uh, as per Han Solo's ability. Uh, okay, and it, we did end up rolling a resource uh, after we resolved the abilities, uh, and I can resolve them in whatever order I want. So we resolve this, and then this, uh, and now uh, I'll go ahead and gain a resource, okay, from uh, Smuggler's Run, and uh, that pretty much is uh, it for my turn. Now we go to Vader, and uh, let's go ahead and use uh, these to um, show that the characters are activated instead of rotating them. So I'm going to activate Vader, okay. Okay, we got uh, two, four, uh, and one. Uh, okay, so that was Vader's turn, and after this character is activated, if the enemy controls a battlefield, each player discards a card, but uh, he doesn't, so that's not gonna matter, his ability is not gonna matter. Okay, so now my turn, I'll activate Luke, and uh, I'll roll his dice. Okay, uh, we got um, two shields, not bad. Um, 
and now uh, Vader uh, will resolve his force. Uh, so each player deals two unblockable damage to one of their characters unless they turn one of their dice to his side, showing black. Uh, and I'm gonna have to repeat that twice. So why don't we, um, let's turn this to a blank. Uh, let's turn this to a blank, okay? Um, and I'll go ahead and resolve this two against um, Vader, so it's going to be minus one shield and then one damage. There we go. Now, uh, that's my turn. On Vader's turn, we activate uh, his, uh, well, resolve his uh, resource side, so we're going to flip this, okay? Uh, all right. Uh, and then uh, we're going to now move on to my turn. I'll, I'll resolve these two shields and I'll distribute them like so, okay? Okay, and then Vader will play one of his cards. Okay, uh, harness the dark side. Each player removes one of their blank dice. Remove two instead if there's a copy of this card in the encounter discard pile. So uh, I'll go ahead and remove this. Uh, and then that has Surge. So play the top card of the encounter deck. Uh, meditation. Uh, so this is a promo card. It's not, this is not part of the um, normal suite of cards for Vader. Okay, uh, but if you uh, print out the uh, Obi-Wan Saga, it comes with this card. So give one shield to the rightmost apprentice um, or Sith enemy character in the enemy row. So that'll be Vader in this case. And then we're going to give him Anticipate 1. So basically we put an Anticipation token. You can use any token you want to represent that on the character um, um, what, with the most health. All right. Uh, in this case, it will be Luke. And then uh, after that character is activated, remove all Anticipation counters from it. And the enemy plays that many cards on the top of the encounter deck. Okay, uh, so next time Luke activates, um, Vader will get a free card. So it's like a reactionary type of uh, effect. Uh, all right, so now that was Vader's uh, turn. Uh, now I will um, I'll play um, hunting rifle on Luke. Okay, and I'll go ahead and bring this over here. Uh, Vader will play a card. So that's Cease. So the enemy claims the battlefield, even if it was already claimed by a player this round. Uh, this doesn't cause the enemy to automatically pass for the rest of the round, as long as he can take and activate, resolve, or play action. So uh, because I decided to wait uh, to claim the battlefield, uh, instead of, um, you know, like I decided to play this instead, uh, Vader took advantage of that and claimed the battlefield earlier than he normally would have. So that's cool. Uh, so now Vader has the battlefield, it's been claimed. Now, we would normally try to trigger the ability, uh, but we're using the enemy claim ability here, and it says if the enemy has no resource, they gain one resource. So uh, they don't get no resource in this case, okay? Uh, all right, and uh, I don't really have anything else to do in my turn, so I'll pass. So we're gonna go to upkeep, and on easy difficulty, the enemy gains one resource. Uh, we're gonna ready our characters, okay? So I'm just going to remove these uh, tokens. Uh, and let's not forget Luke has this anticipation token here. I gain my two resources. I flip the, um, the claimed um, token. And now uh, I'm going to draw up to five. And I'm also going to uh, refresh the enemy row. OK. OK. And we begin a new round. So Vader claimed the battlefield. So that means that he goes first. So we're going to put one of these on him. And we're going to roll, and I'm going to have to discard uh, a card from my hand because it controls the battlefield. So six, four, and three and two. All right, cool. Uh, so now uh, I need to discard a card from my hand. Um, I'll go ahead and discard Hasty Exit. Okay. Um, now the first thing I want to do is um, I'll go ahead and activate Han. Okay. Okay, so we got this, uh, this, and this, uh, and I'm gonna go ahead and reroll this for, okay, got a five. So we went down to um, one damage instead of two, not bad. Uh, so that was Han's turn, uh, and or my turn, and then Vader will um, resolve one of his um, uh, one melee damage that's gonna go against Han because he has the lowest health result. He has one shield, so there we go. That was Vader's turn. Now, um, let's see. I'm going to um, 
I just realized earlier that um, I just realized earlier that uh, Vader, when he resolved his two, uh, it was actually supposed to be a uh, one. Uh, sorry, it, it was supposed to be a um, a disrupt die. Uh, I didn't have resources at the time, but he would have gained a resource, which means that he would have advanced. Okay, so uh, we're just gonna give this to him and roll roll it now. Okay, uh, there. You go. So. I'm just gonna add that there. Okay, fixed. Uh, all right. Uh, so now, all right, uh, solved. Uh, so now he resolved his one, uh, and now uh, on my turn, I'll go ahead and activate look. Uh, so let's roll three. Okay. And now we're gonna resolve this anticipation token. Uh, that's a lot of damage, I like it. So we're gonna resolve this anticipation token. Uh, Vader gets a free card, reinforcements. So we're gonna, uh, we're gonna search the encounter deck for, uh, let's search for stormtroopers. Okay, so um, that was on my turn. Uh, now Vader gets to act, um, in this case, uh, because there's a uh, there's a unit that hasn't been uh, there's a unit that hasn't been uh, activated, uh, we're gonna activate stormtroopers first. Okay, All right. So we get a two. So that's a blank. Uh, now my turn. Uh, I want to uh, I want to go ahead and resolve these range die. Although you know what? Uh, why don't I? Um, I think I can do. I can dish out a lot of damage. So I'll do this. Um, I'll use Alter, okay, to turn these to, uh, let's see, um, let's turn this to a, a, um, a uh, resource side and then a ranged side, okay. Uh, and now Vader will resolve his four, so deal two dam unblockable damage to one of my characters, uh, unless I turn one of my dice to a blank side. Uh, why don't I just turn this, okay. Uh, that's fine. So now um, uh, uh, that was uh, Vader's turn. Now uh, my turn. Uh, I'll uh, let's see. Uh, I'll go ahead and resolve uh, these ranged uh, dice. Uh, so let's do let's do three against the stormtrooper. Okay. All right. So we get rid of that. Uh, it has taunt, so I'm forced to resolve him against the stormtrooper first. Uh, so that leaves me leaves me with one ranged die, and we're gonna resolve it against um, we're gonna resolve it against uh, a two against Vader. So he's gonna go to two damage. Okay, uh, all right. Uh, and then on their turn, so this goes away. Uh, Vader will resolve his three. That's one resource. So uh, gains one resource. Uh, so uh, now. Uh, we're gonna resolve these two resources. Actually, no, I don't want to do that because the enemy is just gonna make me uh, resolve one of them, uh, lose one of them. Um, but you know what I could do? Um, I think I could just claim the battlefield now. Uh, I don't really have a whole. Actually, no. Uh, so I'll go ahead and gain the two. That's all right. Uh, I'll gain the two. Okay. It'll make me lose one, uh, and then I'll claim the battlefield. Okay, and that'll make me gain one resource and draw a card. Okay. Uh, the enemy will just play two cards. So this is Vader's lightsaber. This is a promo. Uh, so if this comes with the uh, squadrons set, if you print it out or buy it. Uh, so um, it says before the first time each round that one of attached characters die uh, showing melee is resolved. Uh, exhaust this to make it unblockable and force each player to discard a card at random from their hand. So that's pretty potent. So I'm going to try to prevent Vader from resolving his melee die, if I can. As long as he doesn't resolve melee dice, uh, lightsaber doesn't have an effect. Uh, all right, and I don't. I, I claim the battlefield, so I don't have anything else to do. So uh, give each enemy character one shield. Easy. Okay. Now we move on to upkeep. So we go to upkeep, and I'm gonna um, go ahead and gain my. Um, I'm up to four resources now. Okay. Uh, remove these uh, exhausted tokens. Uh, and then, um, uh, and then we're gonna uh, draw. Let's refresh this, and then let's let's draw up to, let's draw up to uh, five. So uh, there we go. I'm okay with this. Uh, all right. 
Um, we flip this and uh, we're ready to rock. So now I go first this time. Um, I'm gonna I have four resources. I'm gonna pay two uh, to play Hidden Blaster. I'm gonna play it on Luke this time. Okay, have a uh, extra die here. And then um, uh, that has Ambush, so I remove a shield from my character. Uh, that's the uh, effect from Hidden Blaster. Uh, and now for my next action, because that has Ambush, uh, I'll go ahead and activate it. So uh, I'll, I'll activate Look. Okay. All right. Not bad. Okay. Uh, it's really good, actually. Okay. So now Vader gets to activate. So I'll put that there. Okay. So it looks like Vader is going to be resolving one of his. Um, uh, one of his. Uh, he's going to be swinging the light uh, saber there. Uh, and uh, why don't I reroll? Um, let's see. Uh, let's reroll. Uh, let's see if we can reroll that, but it's not gonna do a whole lot. Um, don't think so. Let's see. Okay, uh, now we get to reroll a die. Uh, let's try rerolling that on um, six. Okay, oh, that didn't work. Okay, uh, so that's my turn. Now Vader will resolve this too, uh, and he'll make me discard a card at random. Uh, so we're gonna rotate this uh, lightsaber. Uh, so I'm gonna um, I'm gonna discard a card at random. So I'll just roll a die. Uh, one, two, three, four. So that's a three. Okay. So we're gonna discard this. Okay. And um, uh, and then the damage is supposed to be unblockable, uh, but uh, not that he has any shields anyway. So that's fine. Um, uh, okay. And then um, that so that was the six. Now my turn. Uh, I'll resolve a bunch of damage. So um, let's resolve, uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, so that's five, so I'll resolve five, uh, so seven, let's resolve that seven, so that's nine, okay, against Vader, uh, and then, uh, let's move on to Vader, and there's no reason why I'm leaving that behind, by the way, uh, so you'll see in a second, so now, oops, five, so five, we're gonna move it here, that's uh, one damage, uh, so I'm gonna go to Han, Okay, there we go. Uh, now on my turn, I'll use uh, Luke's power action. Okay, uh, so I spend two resources and I resolve one of uh, my character's character or uh, upgrade dice, um, increasing its value by two. So I'll deal four damage to Vader. So that's one, and then that goes up to 13. Okay, uh, there you go. Okay, and now uh, Vader is going to advance, so he's going to gain a resource, and this is going to be flipped. Uh, and on my turn, uh, I'll gain two resources. Okay, uh, and then the enemy will play a card. We roll. Okay, uh, cool. Uh, let's see. Um, uh, I think I'm just going to claim the battlefield um yeah i think actually let me go ahead and uh, play hide net hyphen awareness i'll give three shields to han and that has ambush uh, i'll go ahead and then claim the battlefield okay so i gain a resource and draw a card okay uh, now vader will do two damage to han so get rid of two of the shields uh, i've claimed the battlefield i don't have anything else to do so Vader will force me to, to deal two unblockable damage to one of my characters, so I'm gonna go to Luke. We play another card, lightsaber throw, deal one unblockable damage to each player's characters, and if this kills a character, um, the card gains surge. Okay. Um, uh, yep. Uh, and uh, yeah, I just have to keep letting him do its his thing. Each player removes one of. Uh, their dice showing blank. Yeah, I don't have any, but it has surge, so we just play the top part of the encounter deck. Uh, each player turns two of their dice to a side, not showing damage, uh, and deal one unblockable damage to the enemy layer. Um, and uh, that is supposed to happen. Uh, I think I should have a rat at that at some point, but I'm supposed to deal one damage to the enemy leader if 
I turn the dice. If I don't turn any dice, then uh, we don't we don't resolve the one damage um, part. Um, okay. Uh, now uh, that is it. Uh, so we now move on to uh, upkeep. So that's uh, three uh, resources. Uh, flip this. He gains a resource. I draw. Let me discard this because because uh, he just doesn't have any uh, uh, ranged cards, uh, ranged damage. Actually, no. <laughs> Let me just discard one because I don't want to run out of cards. I'm a bit concerned with that, so I'll keep one. All right, good. And then uh, we refresh uh, Vader's hand, uh, and everything looks good. So I go first again. Um, I don't really want to play any upgrades yet, so, or actually, I think I do. I take that back. Um, or not. Yeah, uh, let's do that. So uh, I'll go ahead and pay three. Uh, and uh, play Heirloom Lightsaber on Luke. Uh, there we go. Heirloom Lightsaber, and um, that doesn't have Ambush or anything, so now we go ahead and activate Vader. Uh, okay. Okay, so two, one, one, uh, six, uh, and then five. Okay, looks like we're going to be activating some... Um, uh, some um, damage with the lightsaber there. Um, I'll play Smuggler's Run on Han. Uh, so I'll activate him. Uh, okay, and then if I roll resources, I gain a resource. Okay, looks like I didn't roll resources, but uh, instead of rerolling one of his dice, I'll go ahead and reroll Vader's. Uh... Ah, wow, that, that happened again. That was the thing. Okay, uh, so. Uh, so that was my activation, and now Vader will go ahead and swing his lightsaber again, so exhaust, uh, and uh, so that'll be unblockable damage, so that's two unblockable damage to Han, okay, uh, and uh, then I have to discard a card at random, so uh, let's see, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, one, so we discard this, okay, there we go, uh, and now my turn, I'll go ahead and activate look. It looks like I forgot to remove that earlier, uh, but let's go. Okay, uh, not bad. Um, okay, got some melee damage going on. And more range damage, love it. Okay, so now another damage to Vader, not to Vader, to Han. Uh, actually, there's a shield on him, so there. Okay. Um, and then... Uh, on my turn, uh, I can do a whole bunch of um, melee damage. I don't have any resources, sadly, but um, why don't we first, let's play this uh, so that we discard a card at random from Vader's hand. So we got uh, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Okay, uh, so this one. Uh, that's unfortunate. Okay. I would have preferred discarding one of these if possible, but uh, well, so that's how the discarding works, uh, but that's that. Um, now, Vader will make me lose a resource. I don't have any resources, so that uh, suits me fine. Uh, now, uh, I want to uh, resolve my um, ranged dice, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, uh, eight, nine, yep, nine. Uh, yep, checks out. So that's 9 damage, uh, so Vader is at 22 damage. Okay, 22. Cool. Uh, now we play a card. Okay, so Imperial War Machine. Um, and the first effect doesn't matter uh, until we get a Stormtrooper in play. And I can resolve my vehicle damage against it, my, uh, but I don't have a vehicle. So the effects don't matter, we only care about the, it rolling its dice. Okay, uh, so that was the enemy's turn. And uh, we resolve two uh, against Vader, so he's up 24 damage. Uh, and uh, it looks like that's it. <laughs> so um, Vader is defeated. He doesn't have any extra health or anything. So uh, that was relatively quick. Uh, but uh, yeah, so that was playing on, on easy. I just uh, I haven't played against him with these pre improved pre-constructed decks in a while. So uh, I wanted to make sure it wasn't too difficult. Uh, but yeah, these improved uh, starter decks are meant 
to go up against uh, easy or may maybe even normal difficulty uh, if you're comfortable or know, or know, know what you're doing when playing against the enemy. Uh, but that was it. That was uh, Luke and Han, uh, and Han against Vader. And I want to thank you so much for watching. If you have any comments, questions, feedback, go ahead and put them in the comment section. If you enjoy this content, make sure to like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.